Hello, welcome back to Youth Noon Experience. We're playing Slender the Eight Pages. We've got one. Slender's somewhere nearby. We've just outrun him. Um, let's find these other pages and piece together his diary entries or something. I don't know. Um, yeah, that's a question. What happens if you do find all these? We win. What do we win? I don't know. A chance to get out of this forest and survive. That's what the off button's for. I know. And I shall be hitting it with some joy at the end of this recording. Please. Yes. So if you want us to play Slender Man again, no. you're going to have to come around here and force us to. You really are. I'm I'm sorry, people. I Stand behind him with a knife or a gun. I, I get it. I get why people enjoyed it but I'm bored I'm bored Resident Evil that, that there's there's a scary game Silent Hill Silent Hill way better obviously it's unfair to compare this little indie game composed by a couple of dudes with some free time for n no profit. It's unfair to put them up against Silent Hill. But like, Silent Hill? Yeah, it's an actual paid for developed horror game. Scary, scary. Yeah, but hills aren't normally noisy anyway. <laughs> yeah, well they all have these silly names, don't they? <clears throat> Because if you give your scary game a scary title, it's a little too on the nose and comes out sounding like a B-movie. I mean, you know, Villa of the Blood Splattering Zombies just sounds like, you know, you should be wearing it with the 3D glasses <laughs> that are red and blue cellophane stuck to some cardboard. Yeah. Okay then. Horror films. Horror films. Yes. What do you reckon is the most horrible horror horror horror? horror? The most horror 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 horror. Horror. <laughs> Horrifying horror film. Horror at your girl. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no horror back girl. Um. What do I reckon is the most horrible horror film? Yeah. Ah. Are we talking about a horror film that actually scared me, are we? Possibly one that scared you, or one that you sort of like, oh, I don't want to watch that again, or whatever. <clears throat> I mean, like, Hellraiser is... The thing with the, the fish hooks tearing that guy to pieces is pretty grim. Well, yeah, gore's always... Horrible, messy ways of dying is always a way of... <clears throat> I mean, my least favourite, the ones that I really cringe watching are Saw and things like that because of the the ways that people want to play a game. When, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, to get out of this, you have to saw your foot off and all that sort of things. I mean, I can remember seeing, I don't know which saw it was, but there was a guy in this thing that rotated his arms and his legs until the bones snapped and came out through the... and I was like, whoa, hang on, I'm not really sure I wanted to see that. So have you got one? I don't know, um... I'm trying to think of ones I've watched. I'm not... oh great, torch is dying. Um... I'm not a big horror film fan. No, it's ever. not really been my genre. I, I studied a lot of horror films in college as part of my film studies thing. So that for me has helped me sort of dissect horror films in advance before anything happens. Oh, look, a page! We're going to equal our high score, are we? Yeah. Yay! Unfortunately, we have basically no battery left in the torch at this point. So I think we're just going to... This, this is going to be it for us. 
It's only a matter of time now before we die. Mm. So you can't think of one that... I can't think of one that's stuck in my head as like, oh no, ah. And besides, my favourite horror films are always the really, like, not scary ones. The schlocky ones. Schlock, yeah, schlock horror films. <clears throat> um, what about Final Destination? <sighs> Interesting concept that death will find you, even if you've given him the slip sort of thing. <clears throat> Yeah. And then you have the whole trials of Sisyphus. But you can't say that again, Pat. Trials of Sisyphus. Yes, but no, I mean, yeah, that thing in Saw was horrible. Because you can kind of feel that, if you know what I mean. It's a very visceral sort of oh, yeah, that's image. <coughs> Especially for me, having had my leg break and come out through the skin. It, I know it's not pleasant. <coughs> yes. I'm a very fortunate man. I've gotten 24 years old and I've never broken anything. Including a sweat. Aye. I'm, I'm breaking a sweat going through these forests. But we're doing well. We've got two pages and we're not dead. <laughs> so is he jinxing us? Yeah, I've just... I'm doomed this. We're done for. What's this? Just a wall. Oh, I see. It's the edges of the tunnel, thing tunnel isn't it? We went down and got killed. Mind you, there isn't anywhere we have been that we haven't got killed. <laughs> I was going to say, but there isn't exactly den. <laughs> Get to the truck and like, ah, 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 you can't kill me, I'm touching the truck. And suddenly I'm like, ah. Alright, but you can only stand there for ten seconds to catch your breath. I wonder if there's anywhere here that you can actually find batteries for this pathetically weak torch. No, I think we were supposed to be smart with how we used it. Either that or get through this game quicker than we have done. Maybe these pages are all actually very close together and we're just idiots. Well, we are idiots. Well, even more idiotic than usual. Wow, that's a thing? You can do that? Amazing. He outran him slightly. <sighs> Come on. See now I'm now I'm bored and frustrated because I know I'm gonna run out of battery and I know I have no idea where I am. It, yeah, I've run out of battery. There we go. You wouldn't believe that I'm turning the torch on and off because all you can see is black. Yeah. So I know I'm done for. There's I'm nothing I can do. Yeah. There's nothing to do at this point. I can just. That's a wall. I can tell I'm not making progress. Even if I find the pages now, I can't pick them up because I can't see them to grab them. Yeah, you can just wander around staring at the sky until Slender Man gets you. There's fire, apparently. There's what? Well, look at that. There's crackling noises and smoke in the air, so something's on fire. How has he not grabbed us by now? Come on, kill me. Well, perhaps he can't see you because you've got your torch switched off. Yeah, how would he? Mm -hmm. I could have it switched on full blast for all I know. There's no battery. This is it, people. This is the quality content you get here. Two grumpy blokes wandering around in the dark, staring at the sky for the only source of light. <coughs> Waiting to get murdered. Right, I know you're near. Come on, just finish me off. I'm done. There. there you go. Hi. Oh, and you know what was so close to the ten minute mark? I don't think we're going to have time to do another attack. Oh, no. oh, oh no, oh dear. I'm bereft.
Mm. Oh, sad, sad times. Yeah. Go stop. Oh, oh dear. Well, wasn't that tedious? That was. Um, <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. What a contrast to come from my time in Porsche, which is like this really expansive, interactive world, to to this the forest that you can just <laughs> tramp around and get caught get by. Get murdered guy. in a bunch of times. Yeah. Yeah. So, thank you very much to the person that suggested we play this. Please don't suggest anything else. <laughs> no, no, let's encourage suggestions. That's that's what we want. We did what they wanted. Hopefully it has been appreciated. If nothing else, we have dismantled all fear associated with this game. It's a public service. So anyone who's playing this and getting all jumpy scared and being like, you know, oh, this game is so scary, can watch our playthroughs of it and totally disarm the fear of the situation. You know, it's like I'm casting Ridiculous on the Boggart or something from uh. Harry Potter. <laughs> oh, I'm scared of Snape. Well, now it's Snape in women's clothing. And it's like, oh, he's not so scary. We've done that to Slender Man. It's like, ah, oh, Slender Man's so scary. And now he's boring. <laughs> it's just Oh yeah, I'm not scared anymore. We have we have com completed a public service. Yes. We have disarmed the Slender Man. Mainly by using the off button or the pause switch or whatever. And grumbling. Yes. The art of grumbling and not enjoying ourselves. Nah. Best way to enjoy this game is to not have fun with it. The scariest thing about this game was that bloody mad guard I put in. That was horrible. <laughs> That really was free. Uh, and don't say it's because we're playing it together because uh, I'd, I'd still be bored. I jump a couple of times and then I get bored. And believe me, he does, he gets jumpy. Yeah, I, I am, I, I am jumpy. I've only got to turn the corner and he jumps. Mind you, that's partly to do with my face. <laughs> oh, what's that? <laughs> yeah, I, I, I look at myself in the mirror and freak out. I think it's because suspense is a hard thing to maintain for a long period of time. And that's what this game is all about. Mm. Long <laughs> periods of time in suspense. But you're, I think there's like a threshold that the brain hits after a while it can't keep this panic Tension. response yeah. going so you can't be <laughs> that and the fact that the game actually warns you when he's going to jump out at you yeah you do get some precognition as to when you're going to die so it's like if your only thing is the startle response and then you warn people that they're about to be startled it's kind of pointless Oh well. Oh well. Ah, that was slender. The eight pages. Of which as we only requested. Managed two. Of which we managed two. Twice. Twice. So does that count as four? Yeah, yeah. We got halfway through the game. Yay! <laughs> we win. Yep. <laughs> Thank you for watching. We hope you've enjoyed this. We tried to. Um, Failed miserably as usual. Please like comments suggestions and criticisms and feedback on our videos below keep it constructive and civil um what else that's it yeah share share to your social media follow us on ours subscribe there's a bell icon next to subscribe you get updates that's all the good things bye for now people that that's us that's we're done goodbye Enjoy. Bye.